I think there's a possibility of reaching people in a fuller way, in a more personal way, especially if you as the pastor not only present the goals of the, the appeal, but show your own commitment by making your pledge during the time of, of the Eucharist. Now there may be some who will say, well, wait a minute, this is a bit like the money changers in the temple. Would I don't think so. I think the Eucharist, which as we know is a response of gratitude, the word means that, is invites us to view gratitude as the as the value that links our whole life. And in the context of the great act of gratitude, which is the Eucharist, families and individuals can be invited to make their own expression of gratitude, which is their support for the United Catholic Appeal. It is a strategy that is well worth trying, and I really hope you're going to give serious consideration to doing it, trying it out this year. I also think that that Sunday, the Sunday when you make the in pew appeal, is not something that should drop out of the sky. You have to prepare the parish by announcing, by articles in your bulletin or on your website, saying on such and such a Sunday, we're all going to consider our participation in the United Catholic Appeal. Here are some of the reasons you should be thinking about before we get there. And that way, people aren't surprised. They may have talked about it then at home, what they can do. And then in a prayerful, grateful context during the, the Eucharist, folks will be, uh, there'll be the possibility for people to engage in this year's Catholic Appeal. Thank you for your priestly ministry. Thank you for their unselfish leadership of the community that has been entrusted to you. And thank you for your friendship and support for me, your brother in the priesthood and your bishop.